right, we're back. Let's get a... Let's get some night diving done. Lupin Tuna. Tuna Sashami. Mmm. That sounds good. This game always makes me want some sushi. So we know we know the deal with this one is basically take anything and everything. We don't really have to be too picky. A zebra shark, yes. So in that case, we could just come on, do my inputs right. Oh yeah, nighttime fish are a little bit tougher too. Zebra shark, we already got. Don't need that. Catch these guys. Never got manis. I don't do a lot of nighttime fishing, so I guess that makes sense. Unless it's a daytime item too, then maybe you only get it after you find the Gadon. White tip. Ow. I think anything tranquilizing in this game is just so much better than any other type of weapon. How else are you supposed to get? Three star of anything. Well, I guess the net gun too is really good. Like most of the time, you're looking for, say that. See, 
that should be good. fish in here. This is like midway, right? Seahorses, fish, anything. And yeah, we can keep that just in case we get into a pickle. If we need it. fish that we need though. And I thought it was because of nighttime. Be able to find like see we don't need press the wrong button it'll put him to sleep. At least that's what I did anyway. At least that's what I did anyways. Just wanted to try to see if it would work and it did. Oh yeah the humble or whatever this squid is. Um Please? There we go. That should be a three star of those if you haven't gotten it. Which it looks like we have. Ah, uh, tricked you. Whoa. We need to send this guy out of here quick and then. I didn't want to send him up, but I felt like I needed to because I wasn't paying attention to our oxygen that we had and I just wasted that one. Notice we had any oxygen stuffed in our back pocket. Still no. Uh, what do you call them? Seahorses. There's like a total of four, I think, that we're missing. I'm doing my best to explore the whole map, but I don't know. Don't know what I'm doing wrong. Kind of rush through the beginning of the game so we can get to the newer content. Now maybe I'm paying for that. Oh yeah, the eels. What'd you think about that fish? 
How did that feel? Hurt my feelings? I hurt your face. How strong? Go away. How strong are the box jellyfish? They're pretty strong. Pretty strong. Is that it for all the fish around here? tell which which fish I actually like and which ones I really don't like the so ones I don't like I just smack them until they die and then throw them away the ones I do want I actually go for but some of them are more rare and some of them are just annoying. Like these are annoying. Don't like the barracudas. And why is it that I only find triple axles? It's the only gun in the game I ever find. I think we have one more. What is going on right now? I might die just because of this lag. I don't have any more. Okay. That's what I was making sure of. Making sure we used all three of them. Grab the iron. Open this up. Ah, oh, the cat food. I keep forgetting about that. Alright. Let's get out of here. I think that's good. Wish they would just add more. More fish and more reason to go into the go night diving. Unless I'm missing something. But it seems like the only reason why you want to go night diving is for um couple species of fish and the marine commissions all right let's go make some money It just occurred to me when we were doing the sharks we could have replaced the first two. Oh hey. Alex the fish fryer. Hello everyone, this is Yui from NDC Station. Good to see you again. I'm Vincent Yakamova. Here he is, appearing out of nowhere again. The previous episode challenge the chef was was as hot as molten lava. 
It was truly an interesting development. And in today's episode, a new challenger appears. <clears throat> Let me introduce you to Alex Cooper. That's supposed to be a reference to Alice Cooper? Cooks as platinum rank chef in the United Kingdom. No, it's not. Ah, oh, you must be the sh sushi chef, everybody. Or who beat Wang Pang in the last competition, yes? I expected a fancier restaurant than this. Your establishment is humble indeed. Oh, the challenger is provoking the champion. This will be an exciting match. Today's theme is Fry of the Sea. Both Japan and the United Kingdom are popular for their fried dishes. The dishes may look similar, but are authentic eat, but are authentic each in their own way. Whose dish will please the play of our palate of Vincent, the judge? Can you guess the winner? My mouth is watering already. Like before, we'll give you two days. I repeat, you have two days to compete. Dear audience, this match will be fire. Stay tuned and see what transpires in today's challenge, The Chef. Wonder how many of these there are. Ooh, it was an easy one this time. Your fried fried sea bream or black tiger shrimp will win the day easily. My choice is deep sea fish, but why? There are well-known recipes and I don't want to just replicate the taste. I took up the kitchen knife to explore new ingredients and tastes of the sea. The flesh will be deep sea fish. Or the flesh of deep sea fish is usually soft and gelatinous. I will fry it and harden it to add flavor and texture. But you're not familiar with deep deep fish recipes. What if Vincent doesn't like your dish? Don't worry, I'll cook the best deep sea fish. Today's main ingredients are cookie cutter sharks, vampire squids, and binocular fish. The line is quite ambitious. Well, I trust your hunch, Boncho. I'll try to secure them. Okay. Okay. We can actually unlock another recipe. Trout and sea grapes? Let's just make as much money as possible. Oops. Um, control was to enhance. We only have one serving. We can start selling Mega Melts and Smooth Hammerhead. And we'll have to change the ingredients. Oops. Change the ingredients. Um, keep doing that. Oh, it's two. I've been pressing three. Much are you to train? Three thousand. You're three thousand. Maki, how much are you? Two thousand. I feel like they're fine in the kitchen. Um, are you ready to open up? Don't need any of that. 
think we are. Let's see how much better tonight goes. What? I thought you were serving drinks. Oh, he serves the drinks, okay. We have everything covered? Way better. Oh, um, that's the last customer. Quite the skilled chef. Might need to upgrade them a couple more times and then they should be good. I think we needed to talk to Cobra. I forgot about that. Hey, chapter six, Melting Glacier. Oh wait. Dave, is everything going well? Um, I opened the passage to the glacial area, but I can't explore the area because it's too cold. Oh, your current suit is not warm enough, I see. So the people, the sea people gave me this cloth, but I don't know how to use it. The cloth, is, the cloth is warm to the touch. This is a breathing apparatus found in the sea people's cave. I can make a cold resistant suit if I have a mechanical part that can patch up the items. Mechanical part? Don't you have one from John Watson's suit? Mm. Oh, I thought we got to make the suit. You're right. Actually, I brought some complex mechanical parts. This is a device that automatically adjusts water pressure. I may be able to do something with this, but it's too damaged to be used without repair. Only if you could find one intact somewhere. Oh, I have a good idea. What is it? I will tell you later in the evening. I need to organize my thoughts, haha. Mm -hmm. I have a bad feeling about this. Alright. Huh. Some kind of mail is here. Should I check it? The cucumberers. Hello folks, we are a group of people who are just addicted to cucumber. You can simply call or call us the cucumber holics. If you see anyone picking cucumber out of their food, tell them they need to learn how to appreciate the two ta true taste of cucumber. We will host a cucumber party in three days to educate people on cucumber's great taste. They're delicious and they're great for your skin. Any store owners who serve dishes containing cucumber may participate in the cooking contest. Remember, cucumber is green love. The cucumber holics. Mm. Well, not everyone loves cucumber. In fact, I don't like cucumber either. I can't stand the smell. There are many recipes that use fresh cucumber. Anyways, they are hosting an event around here. I need to be prepared to boost revenue that day. By the way, have I seen any cucumber at the farm? I should go ask Otto. All right, let's buy this and this, and we'll end the episode right there. Thanks for watching.